Dear family and friends, ladies and gentlemen, today I'm here at uh, Kyoto Salt Range, the second largest salt mine in the world, which is uh, 600 kilometer long and uh, 6 to 12 kilometer wide with 2200 meter deep. So, this is the second largest salt mine in the world which was discovered uh, during the invasion of Alexander the Great when he invaded India. 326 BC, it stayed in business from 326 BC till today. After Alexander, of course, the Mughals, they traded the salt and after Mughals, it was six and after six, it was taken over by the British. Uh, for 200 years, they traded the salt, uh, which is the best pink Himalayan salt is 99% pure halite. It's simply eatable. You don't need to do any uh, medication, filtration, or purification. This is all purely uh, used as a food. In food, for different purposes, it's being used. So this is uh, uh, pink Himalayan salt. The second largest mine of the salt that's found in Pakistan, Punjab, Kyoto Salt Range. And today we are here to explore uh, how this is being graded. And of course now we are out of the tunnels here where they grade all the salt into different and they load them over to these beautiful trucks to carry them off into factories or to sell them into the cities. So here the workers you can see they are busy uh, grading them into different sizes. Yes, very nice. Sorry, I got into your. So, here you see the. <laughs> the pink Himalayan salt, Kyoto salt range, Punjab, Pakistan which has more than 800 million tons of salt still in this mountain range which is more than 300 kilometers long and it, today we are capable to extract almost 35,000 tons of salt every year from these mountain ranges and if we continue with 35,000 tons of salt every year, we still have the salt for 600 years more. And you can see here the people, they are loading this nice pink Himalayan salt into big lorries here. These are being taken over to the factories for grinding and for powdering them. You see the hard workers here, they're loading this salt. Himalayan pink salt, such a great treasure the government of Pakistan has. Now they have to learn how to make the money uh, out of this salt. In the past we used to export a lot of salt to India and India used to repack and sell them abroad into the other countries. So normally nowadays uh, I think there is a less export into India but uh, we have to learn how to uh, process it into good packings and sell them into the world 
Uh, it's, uh, this is a uh, and what a good demand around the world, Himalayan pink salt is purely 99% halide and simply edible into the fruit, food or anything. And the amazing thing you can see here, the workers busy doing their job of loading the salt into such a beautiful truck. And Pakistan which is famous for these art, truck art as here you can see such a fantastic truck standing here you can see when the wheels are being decorated so nicely uh, even inside the wheels here you can see that the beauty of the truck Uh, this is the ladder to climb up the track. Here you see, I will try to show you a little bit up from there. Yeah, I'm trying. Uh, in the background you can see here uh, this is a uh, Koda salt range uh, as uh, of course it's one of the treasures that Pakistan has 300 kilometers long Koda salt range and here the workers busy extracting the salt from here uh, and uh, being loaded over to some fantastic beautiful tracks Uh, thank you so much dear uh, uh, viewers, uh, friends and family. I hope you like uh, this video and I hope you will appreciate us in the future to show you some more of these things from around the country. Uh, please do subscribe my channel so that I can go further with more uh, energy. Uh, to pro come up with uh, more videos, uh, go around the places and show you some of the nice places in the country. You have a wonderful day.